Hello all, welcome back to this old save. Sirius Lee's here, and we're finally gonna get around to finishing this Indium base today. Activated Indium on a very peaceful, if not the best looking. <laughs> it's very bright yellow. Everywhere you look is super yellow. Uh, not too keen on it, but at night it looks great. During storms it looks great, and it can't hurt you. So I'm happy enough here. Plus, activated Indium. You know what? I saw KJ's video earlier, and I have not checked uh, my milestones tab in like forever, yet we've got a lot of work to do. I am wondering if this planet counts towards this. That's what I'm wondering. We're at 4.1 souls. Let's see if we can remember to check later. Probably not. All right, we got to head over there. If we take a quick peek can see that I've got one thing set up. That is just a placeholder. Uh, we need to make a bunch more. I've done the same thing over at power. You know what? Uh, should we do power first? I think it might be more important. We have power at our uh, teleporter, but that's from solar, which we could delete if we hook up our power. So, do we have... That's the wrong button. Do we have launch fuel? I've considered that we do might, uh, we do, we do might, we might need tech slots indeed on this thing because I would like launch thrusters. If we're going to have to be calling this in for building, call it into this side of the base, call it into the, over to that side of the base, we probably want launch thrusters because it does take fuel to call a ship in. Ow, my feet. All right, here we go, over at the power. So, we have this one perfectly centered already. Let's get in the build camera and get going here. I have also already pre-colored this floor piece. Uh, I don't think we're gonna do anything fancy. We're not gonna build like a giant base star or anything in the air here. That could be fancy or pretty, but I'm, I just want this to, to work. <laughs> I just want this base to be functional for now producing indium and maybe maybe I know we said we'd get to biodomes we do need biodomes we'll we'll see we'll see about biodomes the thing is I don't want to have to rebuild them later so I do sort of want to get the fancy main base structure built first wherever we put these biodomes may as well be here uh, but I don't want to build a bunch of biodomes and have to delete them all later and then rebuild them again so I don't know maybe biodomes maybe not all right you go away you were going to copy. You, uh, wait, uh, yeah, we didn't call in our ship. Let's do that. <laughs> I'm like, I can't build any of these things. Why can't I build any of these things? We have got our build-a-ball ship here. It's, it's to make things buildable. So we've got resources now. Uh, I'm standing right where we're going to be putting things. Let's get... Maybe on this side of the... There we go. Had to go all the way over it. <laughs> all right. Build camera. One more time here. There we go. So, this is colored. Uh, light blue with the white. And so is this floor. So it doesn't matter whether or not this one is colored. We're going to copy that. We can build 174 of these. I think we're gonna go with, we probably don't even need 10, but let's build 10, it's a B class. Normally I'd go with less, but B class is low. So, put it in the cache, copy that. I'm gonna put it at this level, I think. It's one. Cache, copy, snap. You know what, I might, need to get rid of that uh, short wall piece. So that's two. I'm going to go to this and delete that. I don't need it in. I can put it in later. Uh, so we need to copy one of these. Cache, copy, snap, place. And when I'm hitting place that I'm also hitting the wire button uh, Q on keyboard. You have to do it at the same time. That's four, right? Uh-oh, I lost count. We're going to say that's four. Oh, did the wrong thing there. 
There we go. Oh, failed on that one. Five. No, that didn't work. Copy that again. Oh, I think I have to back out all the way to here. Uh, it doesn't matter what we pick, but I may as well pick one of these. Copy it from there. There we go. That's six. Seven. Uh, no, I put the floor in some. I've never done that way before. Neat. Uh, I have to delete that. Copy this. That should be eight, I think. <laughs> Nine. Ten. All right. And now I want to copy the floor and actually place it. And if I copy the floor, it'll keep its color. So I can delete this one now. We can put it back in later. We're going to delete this one now and get our resources back. Uh, now maybe I can put in some walls. You know what we could do is put in something like alloy arch. But color it by copying the floor. There we go. Now we have some light blue short wall or walls here, whatever. All right, there. Power is pretty much done. Let's delete that excess wall. Thank you. We have to wire it, however. So, let's get out of build camera. And what do wires take to build? Anything? I don't know that they take any resources at all, to be honest. It says I can only build one. <laughs> so we're going to snap it to the farthest point, and we're going to see if along the way here to the base, at any point before we are not able to place this wire, if there's a part where we can place it lower than the... Uh, electromagnetic generator like a cave or just a divot does not look like it we're gonna run out of room here any second so you know what we're just gonna place it in this lower portion of ground here somewhere like that the ground should cover it up I think <clears throat> for now now we'll snap it to there we do have a new wire. Yeah, make sure you've actually snapped it. <laughs> we can use our rocket boots. We don't want to go too far, though. If we lose our connection to our wire, we're going to have to walk backwards. Yeah, see, so we went too far, I think. Let's, uh, let's snap it into these trees here. Snap a new one to this one. I am snapped, right? No, I am not. I just drew a second wire here. I'm getting some lag suddenly, so let's see. What are we doing? Uh, camera, delete, delete. How do I target this wire? Let's see, let's go into build camera. I can't see anything here. I want to delete just this one. There we go. Okay, perfect. So now I want to go into out of build camera, actually. Back into wiring mode. There we go. Snap. I saw the angle change, so I know it's snapped, but let's just pull a wire into the air to make sure. Yes, good, good, good. 
All right, over to the base we go. We are below the base right now, so this is nice. We should just be able to snap it to that battery and have it not be uh, too apparent, not having to dig it or anything. And it looks like I am already going to have to reload the game because I'm getting some really bad uh, lag here. Really, really bad. All right, where's that battery at? That's the base computer. Battery's got to be here somewhere. Ah, yeah, here we go. Battery will be the one in the middle. So, can I access the battery? And... Actually, you know what? Let's go into... Out of wire mode. Into build camera. Maybe I can sneak under here without having to delete these floors and stuff. Get rid of the solar panel. Get rid of the solar panel. Looks like we still have power. Yeah, okay, so I want to access that battery now. Let's see how much power we have going on, or if it's going to show even. Uh, available, 2.1K. All right. We're using 20 KP, and we have 2,190 KP. I think we're doing okay. <clears throat> we have way more power than we need. We went overkill there. Okay, so let's call in the ship. And I'm going to do a quick reload, and we're going to come back, I think, at nighttime. Took all day to do that. But I'm happy that the power is hooked up. Now we just need to hook up the mineral extractors. Those are going to take a slight amount more effort than... We're only going to be putting in, I think, four. Maybe we could do eight uh, mineral extractors. Oh, yeah, look at that lag. It is just brutal. Out of nowhere. It was great when I started. It was fantastic. Even going to this menu is helping, so I think it is the planet just a little bit bit but I'm going to be right back and uh, we will continue on building the base let's just do a quick pause and I'll see you in a second all right there we go that's much more smooth already it looks like some so okay I spoke too soon look I took two steps and we got some lag already uh, but that was smooth for a second or two that was beautifully smooth <sighs> <laughs> I need a new computer. I need a new computer. Um, it looked like it's some sort of anti-malware service executable. Some Windows process is using like 20 to 30% of my GPU out of nowhere for no reason whatsoever. Um, just randomly. Like, it's definitely doing it now. Let me, let me, I'm going to go out here. I'm going to Alt-Tab. Uh... No, 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 now it's just No Man's Sky going crazy. 83% of my memory <clears throat> is in No Man's Sky. That's about right. I mean, it's the biggest program I'm running. Uh, that makes sense, I guess. But uh, this is untenable. I might have to scrap this video. I don't know. I'm going to try another, uh, another reload. Because this is awful. I can, like... Make my mouse leave the screen. Yeah. Okay, I'll be right back one more time. Let's give this another try. Sorry, everybody. All right, hopefully third time's a charm here. Let's see. I'm going to try turning the recording on before we get into the game. Maybe that way if the game is smooth when we get into the game, it'll maintain that smoothness instead of me having to alt-tab out of the game Make things go janky and lose that smoothness. I, I don't know. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Uh, we're always going to have a couple of issues loading textures in, like uh, my body. Oh, that was nice and quick. Looks like we got a storm going on. All right. Yeah, you know what? Look, I don't want to. I don't want to jinx it. 
but this is definitely better than we had it just a recent, you know, a couple seconds ago. So let's continue on. And, and hmm, a little bit of some hiccups now. Uh, but I'm just, hmm, hmm. <laughs> I think it's because I'm drawing more terrain in as I'm walking here. All right, so that's probably all it is. If we just jetpack over a whole bunch, it'll load in where we are, lag maybe once, and we'll be good. Okay, first things first. Let's not forget our ship. Teleport receiver is not that far ranged. Uh, another thing I've already done over here is I've uh, rearranged the metal floor so that it is centered with the hotspot. So, build camera. Uh, no, I'm not even in build mode. Z, thank you, or Z, as most people say. Most? I don't know. I don't know. Huh. <laughs> uh, build camera. So, we need to first things first move this floor out one delete it now let's copy this the floor here should also be the proper color blue that I would like so uh, let's do the same thing we had been doing no I did it wrong so what I'm gonna do is take this opportunity to back out and delete that thing because it's getting in the way <laughs> uh, and then we'll copy this no, that didn't work. Why didn't that work? Okay, there. There we go. Alright, so this puts it in facing that direction over there. That's good to know. Let's do that one more time. We're going to do eight of these things. Since we overdid the power, we may as well do eight instead of four. So there's two facing the same direction. So now what we're going to do is copy this floor and rotate it. That's not a rotate button. I'm using the old buttons. Silly me. Okay, let's back out. Copy one of these things. Put it in the queue? No? All right, let's back all the way out. <laughs> Mineral extractor. Go to this mode. We'll just copy one. Queue. Thank you. All right, now how do we rotate this? Ah, with a mouse wheel, right. Okay, so one down is sideways. Two down is the other sideways. And there we go, mirrored. Perfect, okay. Let's try that again. One down, two down. There we go, perfect, okay. Cute. I thought this was going to be way more hard than this. So one down. That should be facing away or towards us. Towards us? Yes, towards us. So we will go one down. There we go. Now we need to go, I think, one up. That looks right. We'll check in that in a sec. We'll go one up. Yeah, I am very happy with that. We've got eight in there, all merged really well together. Uh, we do have to do some extra bit of wiring and um, whatchamacallit-ing, piping, but that's okay. Let's get into that right now. Let's put the floor back. And we'll delete this for now. Uh, we could do the same thing we did on the other side. Why not? Why not? Let's get rid of this one. We were using these. Thank you. Uh, these are going to be a slightly different color of blue, I've just realized. This is a dark blue. That's okay. If it's that much of a concern, what we could really do is use some contextual building to change these things to be thick. Oh, I thought snapping one underneath would do Yeah, it does. Okay. 
Nah, that's fine. That's fine. As is. So, let's back out of here. Go to this menu. Supply pipes. I can build 274. That is plenty. What I want to see is where all these connectors are. That's good. They all seem to be fairly merged with each other, so I'm just going to hook them all up. And just in case any of these things show on any angles, I'll hook that last angle up. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, now we have to hook up power and piping to this thing, so what we're going to do is... Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we've done something wrong here because it's not letting me hook up any piping here. So let's go to... Um, build mode, please. I want to I wanna be able to delete things. Thank you. There we go. And I can't pick any of the pipes. Oh, well, that's a pain. Um, all right, well, we're going to have to redo a bunch of this. Cool. Fun. Copy that, snap it, we'll delete the floor, we'll give one more try to delete the wires from underneath, uh, sorry, the pipes, Ugh, there we go, sometimes changing your angle on these things lets you change uh, what you can or can't delete, no, no, alright, so, delete, oh, that was move. There we go. Still can't see these wires. I'm going to have to delete all of these and do this all again. So this is more complicated than I thought. Good. <laughs> uh, can I delete any of them yet? I just need to delete one. I did not realize once you hooked up all of these pipes, you were doomed. That is interesting to know, though. All right. All pipes deleted. Let's start all over again. We need to go to Mineral Extractor. We need to pick... No, we don't need to pick the color. The floor holds the color. Let's just put this into the queue. Nope. There we go. One. Two. One down. One down. Nope, failed that one. I'm going to back all the way out. There we go. Need one more of those. One and two. There we go. Now we need to go the ups. Ah, oh, what have I done? <laughs> there we go, got one. There we go, we got it all. Okay. Ah, uh, no! Ah! Uh. Okay, okay. Uh, pick a floor. Because this doesn't have the color. That's my problem. So, put that into the queue. We're going to copy a wall. It has the color. Turn it to a floor. Place it in there. Jeepers creepers. <laughs> Let's get this thing done. Uh, this time, we are not going to connect all of the piping. What we're going to do is connect all of them to each other. So, one to that one, this one, to that one, this one, to that one, and then this one. Yay! Okay! <laughs> Jeez Louise! We're just going to put that right here on the ground. 
then we're going to connect from there. We can build a lot of these, remember. So I think we can even leave build camera and not lose our... No, did we lose our pipe? No, we didn't lose our pipe. We can just keep going. Haha. -ha. So let's head back to base, see where we lose connection on this. I feel like pipes are very short, but they might be the same distance as wires. Starship too close? My starship's way... Oh, okay, I'm trying to pull it through the starship. All right, let's cancel this. Get out of wiring mode. Let's move the starship over there. Now it's not too close, right? We still got to get it back here with wires. We're running out of time. Thanks to all that lag stuff. Okay, yeah, no starship in the way now. And you know, I am not too concerned about this showing above ground, actually. So we're just going to draw it there. If it's in valleys, each all the way there, yeah, little, little divots, that should be good. Here's a divot. I saw it before the grass came in. We'll just put it right there. Connect the next one. Take a peek for any caves. I know we have one right beside the base, but I don't know if this pipe will reach it or not. Almost. If this cave comes back at all. Oh yeah, this reaches. Uh, let's put it right down here. And then we'll connect that to our supply depots. Well, actually, we'll probably connect it somewhere under the, the ground here and then to the depots, just so it doesn't come through the floor at a weird angle. It's already weird enough. <laughs> there we go. Uh, that could be better centered, but that's fine. Now let's hook up that power. So we're still in build camera or build mode. Let's go to wiring mode. And we want to go from the battery. No, we're not in wiring mode. Q. No. What am I doing wrong here? We'll just pick wiring, I guess. <laughs> uh, yeah, that node should work. It's all hooked up to the wires. Let's start drawing that. We're going to put that into the cave here, too. Well, divot. Deep divot. Oh, no, there's a cave. Uh, that's great. Let's put it all the way there. It's very deep. And in theory, hooking this up should set everything in motion for these to fill up. Just trying to see if I still have access. It'll tell me when we're gone too far, right? It's hard to see that little green beam <clears throat> behind my head there. You know what? Let's just draw it here in this divot. And then we'll go from there. I think we can reach all the way there. Probably in two. Uh, but we do need to hook all of these up to this wire. And I don't know that I want to hook all of these up at the same moment. Uh, I would, or I do want to hook these all up at the same moment, not one at a time or two at a time, as the case may be. Too far away, too close to Starship. Are you, are you kidding? <laughs> um, that's sort of unacceptable in my opinion. But let's figure out a solution where it doesn't draw too much above the ground. And I'm going to be able to find it. Okay. Is that is that out of range? All right, should be around here somewhere. See, this is why I didn't want to do this. Oh my gosh. 
Um, might show up. No, it's not going to show better at night. The grass is going to be glowing at night. There it is. Phew. Jeez. Okay, come on. Ship has to be out of the way now, right? There. Okay. Now, now what we're going to do is hook all of these up to each other. This one shouldn't give us any problems, but just in case, I'm only going to connect the crossways ones. And then I can hook this one up. Actually, let's hook up the far one up. They are pumping. Okay, we're done. We are done. We're probably going to go over time because I want to make sure this is working. Uh, build camera. Build camera, please. Well, build mode, anyway. Dismiss. Uh, Come on, come on! Let me pick this stupid thing up. There we go. <sighs> okay, yeah, they're all pumping. Now, are they delivering? I also have to go pick up the power. I don't want that to be in the base when I hit upload here. I don't care that we don't have a floor <laughs> over our... Actually, you know what? We can put that in. Uh, I, I think I have enough of these things now. So we'll put in a floor before we hit upload as well. Ooh, we got a disgusting T-Rex guarding the base. He's not aggressive to players, so it's okay. Alright, build. See, uh, copy that. Slide that in there. There we go. I will go check that after. Storage empty. Oh, yeah, that's right. It just hasn't had enough time to fill yet. 25,000 is what we can hold, and I can put more in here just by glitching them in. I think we're doing good. It's going to take eight hours to fill. <laughs> that's fine. That is more than fine. Uh, yeah, I am perfectly happy with this. We are done this base for now. Uh, biodomes will be coming. We have to build biodomes. I am short on plants but not today. Definitely did not have time for this today. Until next time, everybody, have a good time.